Hey, I'm Jamie from Guitarist Magazine, and today we're looking at a British-made hand-wired amp, the Barnett Davies 1530. It's powered by a quartet of EL84 valves, and it's got 12 AX7s in the preamp section. It's a really nice little amp, very portable, and um, as I say, it's, it's a hand-built design, so let's take a look at some of the features. As you can see, the control panel is cantered backwards at 45 degrees, which gives you easier access to the dials when you're standing up. Uh, we like that feature, it's very musician friendly and um, it's a nice touch. The clean channel is governed by this volume control here and you've got bass, middle and treble EQ to play with plus a spring reverb governed by this dial here. Let's have a little listen to the clean channel now. <laughs> I'm going to dial in a little bit of reverb so you can start hearing what that sounds like. Okay, and we crank it all the way up, you're into sort of splashy surf territory. So as you can hear, there's more than enough verb there for the, for the most uh, ardent uh, surf guitar fan. Okay, so let's move on to the overdrive channel. The overdrive channel has its own volume control plus a gain control and the bass, middle and treble EQ as with the clean channel. Let's listen to a few of the sounds that it uh, is capable of. First we'll roll down the gain a little bit so you can hear it when it's more in the crunch zone and then we'll turn it up a little bit more so you can hear the, the full on gain tones this amp is capable of. <laughs> Okay, and let's wind it up to about two thirds of the way around. You can hear there's plenty of nice sort of liquid uh, overdrive tones on tap. Okay, and lastly, we come to one of the most interesting features of this amp, which is that you can actually blend the clean and the overdrive channels together. Now, as we'll, you'll hear in a moment, it's quite a subtle effect, but when you actually join the clean and overdrive channels together, what you end up with is a slightly glassier, more chimey sound than you would get with the overdrive channel on its own. So firstly, let's hear that overdrive channel again on its own, and then I'll A-B it with the blend of the clean and overdrive channels. So here's the overdrive channel on its own. <laughs> Now I'm switching to both channels together. Now obviously how that um, clean and overdrive channel together setting sounds is dependent on how you set up the clean and overdrive channels. So using them relative to each other can yield a, a whole different spectrum of tones. If you go around the back of the amp, there's also some very interesting features there too. As the 1530 name suggests, you can either operate the amp at a full 30 watts or at a half power of 15 watts to get access to those nice crunch tones but at more neighbour friendly volumes. There's also a speaker emulated DI out, which is useful for silent recording. And to accompany that, there's a nice feature which we really like, which is that if you unplug the speaker from the amp, there's a dummy load that prevents you from blowing up your output transformer, basically, if you're running the amp uh, with the speaker disconnected. Finally, the speaker also has an interesting spec. It's a Celestian G12 Century design, which has a rare earth magnet, uh, which makes it lighter compared to, say, an Alnico magnet speaker. So combined with the amp's compact dimensions, it makes for a very portable design. <laughs> 